Want to head back into the drugstore with me? Okay. Lee? Yeah? You're not bad, right? I, uh, why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? No, he wasn't. Oh. Was he bad? He was. Go have a look around outside. Let's have a look around. Okay. Think you can do anything with this? know what I could do. What's that? It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. Let's just hope the power's still on. You can just do that? Well, I memorized all the codes when I was in AV. Let's try. Well fucking done, Doug. All that dark nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? That got a few of them to take notice. But not enough. like TV. Or at least the sound of it. If they were louder, we might be able to clear the street. That guy over there has the keys. How can you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. Just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. Open sesame. That won't work. I was kidding. It's universal, but not that universal. I know, Doug. Doug, you want to get this door open? About that. You got the combo, right? No. Did anyone ever have it? Look, man, there were a lot of those things trying to get in here. And now we can't get back out onto the street. We're also party to some egregious fire code violations. Let's head back inside. Okay. Hey there. That radio sign off didn't sound too good. Are you okay? I'm fine. You're really fine. All of your colleagues are probably dead. You don't think I know that? Of course I'm not fucking fine. God, leave. Just leave me alone.
You ready to head out? You got it. You? Yeah. Let's go. before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. No way. We gotta go. Now. Listen, I was out here looking for gas. And then, up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. I tried to convince her I wasn't and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. A couple almost got me. And I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. We can't just leave her. Damn right we can't. You guys are suicidal. Over a girl. I'm saving her. With or without you. Think about it if it was you. Fine. Let's go save Glenn's damsel in distress. as far as I got when it came to supply gathering. I might have an idea for it. Good luck smothering them to death. That's not really what I have in mind. What are you going to do with that? I don't really know. Do you have any tricks for getting into cars? Not without tools, or making a bunch of noise, and none with pillows. Get out your gun. But the noise? Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. Was sick.
me see the spark plug. The porcelain inside these things turns car windows to tissue paper. Scramble a brain pretty good. That's exactly what I was thinking. behind you.
Hello in there. We're here to help. Please just go away. Let's go, guys. In a minute. If you open up, we can take you somewhere safer. We've got a group in town. No, no, no. Please. She's in trouble. No. Miss, we're coming in. You might want to break through that board first. Stop! Just stop! I'm coming out. You're hurt. Oh, God. I... I said stay away. We need to get you help. It's too late for that. Guys, she's been bitten. What? I told you, I said go away. I'm bit. <laughs> but you wouldn't just leave. Let's calm down. You could be fine. I won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die and, and you come back and you kill anything you can find. You have a boyfriend? When? I don't want that. It's not Christian. Please. Just leave me, please go. Come with us, and we'll find you some help. You have a gun. So? Can I borrow it? What do you mean, borrow? Give it to me. I can just, you know, end this, and then, and then there's no problem. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Please! I don't want to be one of them. They're... they're... satanic. Give it to me, please! This is crazy! Please, step back. It's just two seconds, just one bullet, and I can be with my family, and it'll all be fine. Miss. Back up! Please! Take it easy. I just want to help. You can't. Miss, just relax now. You need to think this through. We'll find you a doctor. It'll be okay. Let's all just... Oh, no, no! no! Get out of here. Shit! Here they come! Get in! Everyone all right? Yeah, we had some close calls, but Glenn is fine and... Well, yeah. We're okay. I've got a few cans of gas for your pickup in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. And things back here? Quiet. Our friend is still in and out over there. He won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. Try to get some rest, hon. How can I with those things out there? How are we doing? If you don't mind, I think my family and I are gonna rest for a bit. Let me know if that asshole over there takes a turn for the worse. You got it. No, I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead guards. Story of the century here, huh? Yeah, and I've got shit for recording equipment. And from the looks of it, there isn't going to be any shortage of first-hand accounts. You do radio? That's right. Well, 
until some piece of shit politicians yank our funding and I hit the blogosphere. I better get back to it. Yep. Thanks, by the way. Don't mention it. Just remember what I said. Yeah, I will. <laughs>